So what makes Kareem different? Unlike other mobile-based driving apps like Uber, Kareem allows passengers to pre-schedule their rides. The company focuses on the passenger's experience in the car. Kareem drivers aren't just drivers, they're captains. And because different markets come with different currencies, financial infrastructure, regulations, and even workforce, Kareem has had to be nimble and adapt quickly. What it boils down to is uh, really understanding local problems and solving them. So when we first started, we were serving consultants and bankers who were traveling the region. And reliability is a, is a massive requirement and very high reliability. And was from some of the initial failures, which were quite painful, but we learned a lot from them, we realized that the maps in the region were, were not accurate. So uh, we decided that we have to actually build maps of the region. Then we decided that even when we had the maps, there were times when a lot of the captains who come from places like Pakistan and India were not able to speak in the same language as the customers. So communication was a bit of a barrier. So we set up a call center through which we could intermediate that communication and make that more effective. So we set up the call center, not just to help customers, but also to help captains. Then over time, we realized that uh, payment was, was an issue, especially in places like uh, Egypt and Saudi and Pakistan. So we came up with other payment options, such as cash and direct telecom billing and so forth. And that so, brings its own challenges as well, because you have to have a, a cash point. You have to be able to figure out how you're going to get that back, not just to the captains, but also to the main business. Absolutely. Talk to me a little bit about those kinds of challenges. Yeah. So cash, while it does look like a very simple <laughs> enhancement to the app, you know, you just select cash instead of a credit card. The, uh, the engine that makes it happen is super complex, as you said. And uh, we typically used to pay our captains on a, on a regular basis. Now, instead of paying them, we need to collect from them. And we need to collect in a way that is very, very convenient for them and, and very, very efficient. So now we have to figure out how do we set up distribution networks, cash collection distribution networks throughout our cities to start collecting this money from them, which is not straightforward. Uh, but this is really a theme in, in the region, right? Some of the basic infrastructure that is required to develop and run a reliable service like ours uh, is not there. Hey, CNBC fans, thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Here you're going to find videos packed with all of the information that you need to be smarter about your finances. You can subscribe by clicking right here and click on all the videos around me or the I right here to watch the latest from CNBC. Thanks for watching.